Prince Harry, Meghan Markle have become irrelevant after Kate Middleton's cancer. Kate Middleton's cancer diagnosis has led her to rethink her priorities, a royal family commentator has implied. In March, the Princess of Wales announced she had cancer. In June, she mentioned she was going through preventative chemotherapy, experiencing both good and bad days. Jenny Bond, a former BBC royal correspondent, believes that the Princess of Wales' experience with cancer has likely made her reassess her life, with her family's well-being now taking precedence. The 42-year-old princess now focuses more on what matters most in her life, particularly her husband, Prince William, and their three children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, Bond suggested. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. Bond suggested that Kate is likely not focused on past issues or anything related to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle now or in the future. According to her, Kate and William view the Duke and Duchess of Sussex as irrelevant. Kate Middleton and Prince William had tried their best to keep their romantic life away from the spotlight for a long time. However, their attempts fell short at a dinner party where the duo was forced to admit their love affair due to a drinking game. According to royal biographer Robert Jobson's new book, Catherine, the Princess of Wales, the couple had attended a dinner party with their friends when those in attendance decided to participate in the popular drinking game Never Have I Ever. It was one of Princess of Wales' ex-girlfriends, Carly Massey Berth, who revealed that Prince William was dating Kate Middleton during the confession-like drinking game, said Jobson in his book. In his biography, Jobson, according to People, wrote, perhaps unwittingly, Carly exposed William's secret love affair with Catherine, much to the prince's chagrin. Royal biographer Katie Nichol too had made the same claim in her 2002 book The Making of a Royal Romance. She announced, I've never dated two people in this room, knowing full well that William was the only one who had because Kate was sitting next to him, a source who attended the party told the author before adding that every single one of the party guests was in shock. The same source alleged that in response, Prince William shot his ex-girlfriend a thunderous look before whispering under his breath, I can't believe you just said that. We knew they were together, the source continued at the time, but it was the first time William confirmed his and Kate's relationship in public. The royal couple first encountered each other in 2001 at St Andrews University in Scotland. Popular rumours suggest that William captivated Middleton by purchasing a £200 front row seat to observe his future wife on the runway at a charity fashion show. Prince William and Kate Middleton's marriage works well because the Princess of Wales has a calming influence, similar to the late Queen. She has helped improve the relationship between William and his father, King Charles. Robert Jobson's book Catherine the Princess of Wales mentions this revelation. The book, which will be published on August 1, states that Diana was headstrong and emotional, and William has turned out to have similar traits. The Daily Mail released an excerpt of the book. A senior source mentions in the book that William and his father have become much closer in recent years. William respects the king's dedication to service but believes Charles' work-first attitude negatively affected their relationship during his childhood. In recent years, they have become much closer. He also respects his father and his devotion to service, but he feels the fact his father put work first had a detrimental impact on him when he was growing up and didn't help their father-son relationship, the source said.